as a recipient of a Zuckerman Fellowship, I felt very uh, grateful to have the opportunity to have a cohort of fellows, as well as uh, folks like Lauren Gary and others, and, and certainly David Gergen, and the entire Center for Public Leadership team, because it really gives you not only a real fellowship, but it's a toolkit. And I can um, unequivocally say that I wouldn't have the opportunity that I have today uh, without this fellowship. Having this, you know, your classes during the week and then the one uh, once a week uh, meeting really gave me a way to develop certain skills that I'm using today. I am fortunate to be the first general counsel of BRAC, which is the world's largest development organization. Uh, it's based in Bangladesh, and it is the oldest and largest provider of microfinance, and it does public health, primary education, water and sanitation. It's the world's largest legal aid clinic. So there's a range of services. And what I, um, you know, the challenges are for me particularly is to develop the, the legal team. And I see myself as an enabler, really, of other people's good works. The, one of the great benefits of BRAC and its successes is its ability to innovate and to really scale up. And so we go into areas that are post-conflict and post-disaster. So we started in Afghanistan in 2002, and our latest uh, expansion has been in Haiti. We were there in really March, February, and after the earthquake was in January. And one of the things that's on my desk right now when I go back uh, to Bangladesh uh, is looking at uh, different uh, you know, projects that we're working on from banking to other services in, uh, uh, in Haiti because people look to us as a, a leader in doing good works in these types of regions. And so I think you know, one of the uh, ways that I want to expand my role and that I learned of is that, you know, what are the tools that are at each of our disposal, whether it's our degree from Harvard, whether it's our fellowship and access to people that you know, we have meetings with, whether it's our own intellect and integrity in the way we do our own work. And we bring it to what we are doing, and we bring that to the table. So for example, in my work at BRAC, what I hope to bring to the table is not only my, my legal work, which I, I hope I'm a good lawyer, I think I'm a you know, good lawyer, but what I hope that I will be valued for more is my judgment and ability to bring people to the table, and really also to help build BRAC's brand. I guess I'd end by saying, within my fellowship, we learned you know, just even practical skills. You know, I remember one of the sessions we had was with, um, I think it was a leader of the Massachusetts legislature, and he was talking about something that had happened in his tenure and some of the difficulties of that. Right now, I have challenges in my own organization. Like I said, I'm operating in an environment that's not familiar to me, uh, in a confine of an organization that has never had a legal counsel, yet has uh, millions of dollars of donor funding and has you know millions of dollars of even outside counsel pro bono work and you know my interfacing with those law firms or with our large donors I play a critical role and yet I am the newest member of the our you know basically our leadership so these are the kinds of things that I would hope and I and I can definitely see that my fellowship uh, and Zuckerman fellowship uh, the ideals at which it wants me to live up to I certainly hope that I can and I'm deeply grateful to Mr. Zuckerman and to the entire Higher Center for Public Leadership because I can say unequivocally that I would not have this opportunity if I didn't have that fellowship.